Hello there fellow dwarves and dwarfettes and welcome back to another episode of my Dark Iron Dwarf Warrior leveling series. In the last episode we completed the... was it Storm... Uh, Shrine of Storms? Uh, the BFA dungeon over in Tiraga... no, it was Stormsong Valley and right now we want to continue our Oh, I cannot fly yet. <laughs> and now, right now, we want to continue our leveling through the Burning Crusade, the Hellfire Peninsula. Okay, let's see. Maybe I'll get a dungeon invite for a Burning Crusade dungeon this time. Last time, the dungeon browser was not able to match us with a party. Maybe this time will be a bit better. Even though the preview of the dungeon finder down here doesn't look too promising, but we will see. <sighs> I, rem I already miss flying. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it, it's already a big advantage that you can uh, ride from level 10 on but it would be an even bigger advantage if you could fly but that's kept to level thir 30 30 what is the first one okay that's the first one this uh, little breach here this why is my computer powering up like mad probably because it's pretty warm today okay that's that's good, that's good. Okay, there is still a bit of muscle memory left, but not too much, to be honest, not too much. Um, what is this buff? It victorious? No, it was not victorious. Oh, whatever. But what I want to do is to change this one. To, come on, stop these damn pop-ups and change this one to Titan panel adjusted, so that my buffs are not underneath the Titan panel panel. Next revenge is. Wait, my next revenge? More pain. I need two more infernals. This shouldn't be too big of a problem. I need to target something first. I need to target something for oh fuck. I don't think I will mess with the fell reaver. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> first of all, let's head over there and grab the talisman. Hmm. 
interesting. I'm leveling so crazy fast that uh, my rested experience that I built up over the last couple of days since I last recorded this character um, is basically already gone. Interesting. Even though I do have a full set. Where's the full set? Yes, the full set of heirlooms, which slows down the rested XP usage quite significantly, but obviously not enough. Hmm. This uh, gives me an idea to play in Panda a Pandaren. They accumulate twice as much. Come on. Twice as much rested experience than any other race. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, first of all, I want to spend a... This goes on my Q button. To target something first. Okay, deal is uh, on five targets. It, it's basically the same. It does a little less damage, but also has the chance to cost no rage at all. So this is basically a good idea. It's an absolute win, so to speak. So. Let's head into a uh, Neltharion's Lair. Ooh, that's a nice dungeon. I like it. Jump. You know what's good for a dungeon? A sip of coffee. A sip of coffee is always a good idea. Up. Get in there. One of these. Come on, just kill this stupid... Yeah, whatever, I don't care. Zoom out a bit. Let's hop down here. Have been tapping into abilities they should not possess. No doubt it has something to do with the latent power still lingering within these rocks. Not a rock. The tray. You would need to cannot attack that target. Against us. I cannot attack that. I cannot, I cannot attack that target. Yet. Not yet. I cannot attack that target. Ah, coffee. Cannot attack that. Okay, that's actually pretty, um, Uneventful. <laughs> they know we're coming now. I hope our allies can keep their main forces occupied long enough for us to complete our mission. Quickly, into the barrels. I'll hold them here and join you down river. No, I won't be doing that. I will find my own path and rejoin you on the other side. Interest swift hand of justice. 
Uh, let's see, can we go past all of those? Or do we have to fight? Looks good, looks good. Which looks good. Yes. Where do I have to go? Yeah, whatever. I don't care. And you pulled? Okay. Must get closer. Didn't I have a target? Where do we go from here? Down this route. Honestly, we're not doing... Uh, I mean, it feels like we're not doing any damage and it is strange because the... I remember Warrior like being absolutely uh, an, an absolute beast when it comes to the, the impact of your spells and of your uh, attacks. It's strange. Okay, one more. Yeah, one more, obviously. Must get closer. I'm out of range. Pay attention, Navarra. I want you to see your heroes I don't have a defensive yet. Oh wait, I, I do, I do. But I don't need it. Because no enemy is doing any damage currently. Hmm. I know I'm, I'm a bit quiet right now and that's just because I have to remember what to do on a prod warrior. Because it's not a druid or it's not a uh, paladin what I play on, on a daily basis basically but it's something I haven't played in absolute ages oh I, I already also forgot to buff the group that's uh, another thing that I'm not yet used to no, I'm not used to having castable buffs Get you in uh, out of the way. Where's the where's the minion? That's oh, over there. Okay, he's probably untauntable. Interesting. I'm sorry. It appears the treasure you seek will be found on the other end of this 
this beast. Okay, let's go. I really miss my Heroic Leap. I remember Heroic Leap was a staple of Warrior gameplay. To the last boss. I am sorry, I know I have seen you now. Yet know this I have witnessed your deeds with pride, and I am sure you will not fail high enough in this final. Rip them apart. Did we actually lose a team member? Healer. Oh, the Peloton left. Right after leaving, uh, right after buffing strength. That's, uh, oh no, I didn't buff strength, it buffs attack power. Yes. So, interesting. This is done. What did we get? We got uh, wrists. That's amazing. Crit haste is better than haste versatility that we have currently. Our plate shoulders. That's the legion leveling plate set. What is this iron? Oh, that's a artifact relic and a back. It's not interesting, and here we do have Thunderclap. I definitely want Thunderclap on my... Oh, where do I put Thunderclap? Maybe I'll use this one here so that I can use Thunderclap. Okay, this has a pretty quick cooldown, generates 5 rage, I mean 5 rage is not much, but that's pretty good. So let's continue leveling, let's continue questing, I mean. Quick dungeon in between is always a good idea. <laughs> nice. Okay, I need the talisman, but I already got it. Interesting. First thing I want to do is get over here. I, th I think this quest giver has the. Oh, I forgot. Has the uh, quests for this uh, orc camp here, where you can, where you have to spy it, uh, spy on it with the eye of kill rock and something like that. I think that's the right. That's this quest, but I'm not entirely sure. I don't usually do. As I told you, I. La, la, la. God damn it, I can't talk. The last time I played uh, Hellfire Peninsula is, is quite some days ago. 12 cursed talismans? Yes, yeah, I think that's the right thing. Well, why are you running away, man? Do not have a target? So what do you want? Smoke beacon. Yeah, give me that. I think one dungeon per episode is is enough. I do want to level quite a bit via questing as well. Come here, hellbore, hellbore, hellbore. How oh, many? Perfect. And 
Only one talisman. Oh god. This drop rate is atrocious. But to be honest, I'm not in a hurry, so... I don't care if this drops barely ever, so... I need to target something first. I will just enjoy the huge pulls I can do as a prod pal uh, prod paladin, yeah. No, I'm not a prod paladin. I can do as a prod warrior. I could do actually big pulls if there were enough um, enemies, but I'm pretty sure if I would have tried to pull those three together with the other pack here, some of those would have reset. I'm pretty sure about that. Okay, and I'm already level 15. That's amazing. Okay, enough of those. Perfect. So, mm, no, I want to do this quest first before I have a look at the other stuff that I just got. I like this. And I already have eight talisman. Talis... Talisman? Talismans? I don't know. I don't care. Okay, uh, three more. Let's head in there because there are also the towers that I have to uh, mark. What? Wait, do I have to mark them, or is this already a kind of explosive to destroy them? What is it? Uh, it is... It, it's a smoke beacon, just as I thought. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe that's the Eye of Kill Rock that I remember. Maybe you don't have to spy on this camp with the, as an Eye of Kill Rock, but... But I'm pretty sure that there's a quest that's uh, pretty... Similar to what I just described. Interesting. not completely uh, sold on the idea of uh, AoE capping. I thought it was always a, a, a nice idea to have completely uncapped AoE, but it's also... It's basically the same thing as it is in uh, Final Fantasy XIV, where they're like the Black Mages... Uh, how's it called? Despair? No, it's... Oh, I haven't played Black Mage in ages. The spell which consumes all your uh, MP. The damage also falls off after like a couple of targets. So that's... So that's not a, a World of Warcraft exclusive idea. But it also uh, gives the opportunity to, to to the devs to 
have some classes shine in AoE, like I think Evoker is uncapped, is it? And other tar uh, other classes to have their strengths in uh, single target. And there's Paladin, <laughs> which is basically capped, but an absolute beast when it comes to uh, AOE. And the next one. Must get closer. I was faster killing mobs than my smoke beacon needed to uh, come off cooldown. That speaks volumes about the, my efficiency. I like playing. What is this? Fell iron? No, I don't need fell iron. Too far away. Oh, interesting. Did they actually fix it or did I just miscalculate my drop down uh, charge? And do this and turn it in. On the way over there, I will have a quick look at my Devastator. Your auto attacks deal an additional 30 physical damage and have 20% chance to reset the remaining cooldown on shield slam. That's basically the same thing that uh, Devastate does, so I don't know. Devastate, Thunderclap, or Revenge, and Execute have a 30% chance to reset the remaining cooldown of, of Shield Slam. That's definitely one th something I need. Last stand, Demoralizing Shout. Uh, last, uh, that's a good idea. Let's put it on uh, Shift 5. Just analog to my... Uh, through it, tank. Bring Warlord Morx Shattered Armor to Corporal Ironridge in Expedition Point. Okay, and you don't have a follow up quest. But before I continue pushing into the enemy's fortress, I mean, fortress is a bit of a, <laughs> of a, uh, no, it's not a fortress. It definitely isn't. It's just a burned down camp. But before I raid the camp, I will end this episode and we will meet, meet again in the next episode, next episode. <laughs> I can't talk today. In the next episode of, uh, my Dark Iron Dwarf Warrior leveling let's play. Until then, champions. Bye.